Hi, I'm Mitch Gallagher from Sweetwater. Today we're checking out Generation 3 of Focusrite's very popular Scarlet family of audio interfaces. Let's get started. There are six different audio interfaces in the Scarlet family, and they share some common features. The Scarlet family connect to your Mac or your PC using USB 2.0. They feature audio resolution up to 24-bit and 192 kilohertz, and they feature enhanced microphone preamps. Now, the preamps in the Scarlet range have always been extremely popular. They're very detailed, they're very accurate, they're nice neutral sounding preamps. And with this generation, those preamps are even better. Plus, Focusrite has added their air feature to all of these audio interfaces. Air allows you to simulate the effect of running through a great audio transformer. It really opens up the top end, gives you even more clarity and detail in the top. All of the Scarlet Audio interfaces include a wide range of bundled software. Focusrite includes the Pro Tools first creative pack, as well as Ableton Live Lite, so you've got two DAWs to choose from. They also include the Focusrite RED 2 and RED 3 plug-in suite, as well as the SoftTube Time & Tone bundle. You can choose one of four of XLN Audio's very popular addictive keys instruments, and you also have access to the Focusrite plugin collective. Now let's take a look at the six members of the Gen 3 Scarlet family. We'll begin with the one here on top, which is the Solo. Solo is a two-in, two-out audio interface, features one microphone preamp, one instrument preamp, a headphone output, stereo monitor outs on the back on PRS balanced quarter-inch connections, as well as direct monitoring so you have no problems with latency when you're overdubbing. The Solo audio interface can be bus powered from your Mac or PC, and it's also available in the Solo Studio Recording Bundle, which you see here to my right. The Studio Recording Bundle includes the CM25 Mark III, which is a large diaphragm cardioid condenser microphone. We also have the HP60 Mark III headphones and a 10-foot microphone cable, along with a mic clip. Next up, we have the Scarlett 2i2 Generation 3 audio interface. This is a two-input, two-output audio interface. We have connections for two line-level inputs, two microphone inputs, as well as two instrument inputs, and you can use any two of those simultaneously. We have stereo monitor outputs on the back, headphone outputs on the front, and the direct monitoring feature as well. The 2i2 can be bus powered, and like the Solo, it's available in the 2i2 Studio Recording Bundle. The Scarlett 4i4, here in the center, offers four simultaneous inputs and four simultaneous outputs. We have two balanced line inputs, two microphone inputs, and two instrument level inputs. We also have four line outputs, MIDI I.O., headphone connections on the front panel, and like the 2i2 and the Solo, this can be bus powered. If you need to connect more line level instruments, for example synthesizers or drum machines, you might want to check out the Scarlett 8i6. The Scarlett 8i6 offers eight inputs and six outputs. We have six balanced line level inputs. We have two microphone level inputs and two instrument level inputs as well. The Scarlett 8i6 offers four line level outputs, MIDI I.O., SPDIF stereo digital I.O., and dual headphone outputs on the front panel. For larger sessions, you want to check out the next member of the Scarlett family. This is the Scarlett 18i8. We have 18 simultaneous inputs and 8 simultaneous outputs. You can route signals into the 8i6 using 8 balanced line level inputs, 4 microphone preamps, dual instrument level preamps, as well as an 8 channel 8 ad digital input. We have dual headphone outputs on the front panel, dual monitor outputs on the back panel, SPDIF stereo digital I.O., and MIDI I.O. And last but certainly not least, we have the largest Scarlett Audio interface, the Scarlett 18i20. This offers 18 simultaneous inputs and 20 simultaneous outputs. The 18i20 offers eight microphone preamps, dual instrument level inputs, as well as six balanced line level inputs. We have 16 channels of optical input via ADAT I.O., as well as stereo digital input and output on SPDIF format. The 18i20 also offers MIDI I.O., as well as a word clock output for synchronizing your various digital devices. We have dual headphone outputs on the front panel, as well as dual monitor outputs on the back. To make recording intuitive and very easy, all of the Scarlett Audio interfaces feature great metering that allows you to instantly see the levels that are coming into the interface. On the first five, we have gain halos that surround the gain controls. On the 18i20, we have LED meters on the front panel. From the Solo to the 18i20, one of these six audio interfaces is perfect as a centerpiece for your recording system. I hope you've enjoyed this overview of the new Scarlett Generation 3 audio interfaces from Focusrite. If you have questions on these or any other products, visit Sweetwater.com or contact your Sweetwater sales engineer. I'm Mitch Gallagher.